What we have here now is the basic technology. First of all, we have the oil smart pump controller here. We have removed the pump from this so and hooked up the light where we could see the visual effect of operating the switch. Now it's important to know that this switch is the pump controller and that means that the pump has to be a manual pump, no float switch. We have two sensors. The short one is the on sensor, the long one is the off sensor. Knowing that the human body is mostly water, if I touch the on sensor, it will turn on. Pump would be running at this point. If then I make contact, which water would be, into the off sensor, when we re go down, the on sensor is clear of water, but the pump will still run until water is removed from the off sensor. The pump is now off. This is the Oil Smart pump controller with the six inch differential between on and off. We have a bottle or uh, some water and oil here. Now we're going to submerge it in through the oil into the water. You see the off sensor is now through the oil into the water. As we come down with the on sensor and it sees water, if you can see that, the on sensor is in the water. Now the pump is going to pump. And as it pumps, we're in reverse here, pulling that switch away. It's going to continue to pump until the off sensor again senses no water, just oil. It turned off. You can see that. I'm going to do it one more time for you. The off sensor is in oil. It goes on down through again. The on sensor goes through the oil into the water, turns on, stays on as the water pumps down. And as soon as the long sensor sees oil or no more water, it turns off. Notice, oil will not contaminate the sensors, which means there is no need to clean the sensors.